Happy Wine Wednesday. So I wanted to uh, showcase one of my most favorite recipes. It's very quick, very fast. Uh, sometimes we do our videos a little longer than expected, but this is a very quick recipe. My five minute broiled mussel. And again, these recipes you won't find anywhere. I always like to have my twist on it. And uh, because I appreciate food so much, I always want to make a fusion. So as you see, you, all the ingredients are here. Hard boiled, uh, hard boiled egg. You've got the mussels, the key star ingredient. Then you've got lemon, of course, orange, soy sauce, sriracha, sesame oil. You got Japanese mayonnaise, and you've got some caviar, some Kaplan caviar. It's optional. Everything's optional. And we've got mozzarella cheese and uh, some chopped green onions. Let's go ahead and dunk these mussels in the boiling hot water. And it'll only take about four minutes or so, four or five minutes or so. So that's going to be boiling for about five minutes. We can quickly make the toppings. So we're going to crush the hard boiled egg like so. Also forgot one key ingredient. It always happens, I always forget an ingredient. Minced crab. I'm going to put a bit of the minced crab in here as well. You always want to use new utensils when touching a new item so it doesn't get contaminated. So again, this is optional, but I love crab meat. So let's put a little bit more. Put a bit of the soy sauce. So, and then I'm going to put some lemon juice. And a bit of orange juice. So I'll add a nice citrusy flavor. It'll lighten up the dish a bit. You don't need to put a lot, as you can see, I put a little bit, a little bit, then some sriracha hot sauce, a bit of sesame oil, a bit of salt, a bit of black pepper, and mayo. This is the binding agent, so I'm going to put a little bit more. We're good. I'm going to mix this up. And of course, I always forget the ingredients, even though it's sitting in front of my face. Caviar. Thank you, Leah, for that. So we'll put a bit in here as well. Add, add a nice bit of color and also a nice bit of crunch. So our topping for our mussels is ready. Now the mussels are also ready by the time we finish our topping. Now I have the oven on broil. Now we're going to plate the, the mussels. So now that we have them plated, we're going to put the, our topping onto it. So here we are. So this is how they look before. And then last but not least, we're going to sprinkle the mozzarella cheese on top. So now we're going to pop it in the oven. Again, it's on broil mode and for five minutes. So as those bad boys are cooking up, it is Wine Wednesday. So I wanted to feature this nice bottle of French wine, which I think will pair very well with the mussels we're having. It's, it's going to be a medium... Uh, bodied wine so it's not going to be your full wine which i think will overpower the muscles too much so let's give it a taste nice color to it give it a bit of swirl of course i think it will go very well so let's check up on uh, the muscles So right on mark, five minutes, mussels are ready. That's exactly the color we're looking for. I wish you can smell it, but you can smell the ingredients that we put in earlier. They're not overcooked. The cheese is cooked just right. So I'm going to go ahead and plate them and then we're going to try it. So here's our finished product. As mentioned, it's quick, easily, easy, it's reliable and it's tasty. So let's give it a shot. Mm. 
that tastes very nice. Let's see how that pairs with the wine. Works perfectly. I need to have one more. Cheers. Very good. One more sip of the wine. Thanks again for watching. Live to eat, not eat to live.